できたよ美味しくできたよ俺はタレが食だよタレができたよ山盛りできたよこれでビカはカレーざんまい飯つけてるかってうまいうまいうまいうまいよ福神漬けもそうえなきゃねえから言うから言うから言うから言うわ疑惑のカレーをかな「ガンジスの大地から」「世界中の人々のためにやってきた」「ハウスのククレにバーモントにココマロリージャーボンカレー」「ポークにビーフにキーマリマサラ」「グリーンカレーも守備範囲」「ランナラランナラランナラランナラランナラランナラランナラランナラランナラランナラランナラランナラランナラランナラランナラランナラランナラランナラランナラランナラランナラ食べたよ「おいしく食べたよおかわりしすぎちゃった」「カレーを食べたよ3日分食べたよそこにカレーがある限り」「これ以上食べれない満腹満腹満腹満腹明日の分も作らなきゃ食べるぞ食べるぞ食べるぞ食べるぞ」「魔性のカレーを」「アジアのインダスの恵みから」「スパイスの宝石をまといやってきた」ここ一号号シーアンシー吉野家松屋にインディーラーデューデュアデューアダマディリアビーバババッポッペラリンチョーランダラランダラランダラランダラランダラランダラランダラランダラランダラこれはカレーと共にあるこの世はカレーで宇宙はカレーで俺はカレーでできている Welcome Hey there Jim Poos Good to see you So, Snake Eater. Uh, we are going to be playing the um, uh, the Steam version, thanks to A Woods. Uh huh. The uh, let's check the options real fast here. Fine. Let's knock that down a notch. Uh, this is. I forget what the thing said. But it came complete with a disclaimer that stuff happened. Stuff in this game is product of an older time. So I guess we'll all have to remember that when we're playing. Get an idea what our buttons do. Uh, all right. Maybe it won't tell us. Okay, so first of all, for full disclosure, I have played two games in the Metal Gear series at all. They are MG1 and uh, Snake's Revenge, for both for the NES. Yeah, I guess apparently something in this. Could potentially cause uh, people to be upset. So I know nothing. So I guess uh, you know we'll see what we got. But yeah, they felt uh, strongly enough about it that they put a, a, a disclaimer on it. So well, here we are. <laughs> we'll see what it turns out to be. I guess. Now. Green playbook, master book, blah blah blah. Let's see. If playing North American and European versions, save data is shared, not compatible with Japanese version. Okay, well, we're not worried about that. Oh, we could play it in French. Boy, if Psych were here, that'd be perfect. That'd be weird, actually. Snake speaking French? I don't know. I don't have to think about it. Okay, so. 
I mean, I almost feel like I should look at the manual, but if there's not at least a little tutorial in this, I'm going to be really, uh, not going to really know what to say about it. Now let me know how the, uh, volume balancing is there. If I need to turn this down some more, it's probably best to know now. Although I have to imagine that we'll, uh, you know, have the ability to do so. Okay, let's get this thing started. I am told nothing about this game other than the opening is great. Yep. Game? What? Uh... There we go. That was really strange. It's like the game decided to explode. All right, we'll, uh... We'll adjust the, um, the audio. Blood on. Da, 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 da. Real-time cuts means additional settings, audio settings. There. Let's uh, take that down another notch and see if that helps. Mouse sensitivity is irrelevant. Screen settings should be fine because it's windowed. Okay. Captions on, we want that. Normal, normal third person view. Blood, blood, blood. More blood from the blood god. Special mode? Uh, I don't think we want to deal with that. Let's go. I'm playing MGS series for the first time. I will play it on easy. I'm not going to play it on very easy. I'm going to play it on easy because this is my first MGS. Don't at me, you know? Uh, I don't really know enough about what to expect. I mean, here I am justifying myself. And really, did, you know, this is what I feel comfortable doing. So uh, let's do it. After the end of World oh. War II, okay. the world was split into two, East and West. This marked the beginning of the era called the Cold War. Yes. Approaching Soviet airspace. 20 minutes to drop off. Commencing internal depressurization. Equipment check. Arm main parachute. All right. You ready to go? Drop zone still showing a high pressure mass. I got your high Cap pressure okay. mass right here. Good. What? We've got high visibility. Cigar. Connecting oxygen hose to interior connector. Put on your mask. Put on my cigar. Who do you think you are? You're just some guy in a mask. Does this panty waste know what he's doing? Well, there's a there's an insult I haven't heard in a long time. Approaching release point. Ten minutes to drop off. Hey, are you deaf? It's a very sixties insult. Cigar and put on your mask. Deep 
depressurization complete. Checking oxygen supply. Six minutes to drop off. Opening rear hatch. Uh-huh. Last time I was on a plane like this, I was trying to get into it. Sunrise. Temperature minus 46 degrees Celsius. Two That's minutes looking to drop cool. Off. Stand up. You'll be falling at 130 miles per hour. Try not to get frostbite from the wind chill. One minute to drop off. Move to the rear. Activate the alarm bottle. This is one for the history books. The world's first halo jump. Ten seconds to drop off. Stand by. Status okay, all green. Prepare for drop off. Countdown. Five, four, three, two, one. Spread your wings and fly. God be with you. Meow. Thank you, Chris. Jack, I've got some important news. Who's Jack? The head of the CIA has finally given us the green light for the virtuous mission. Virtual mission? Uh. No, the virtuous mission. The future of our Fox unit depends on it. If it succeeds, we'll be officially organized into a unit. Virtuous mission? Sounds like some kind of initiation ritual. It does. No, don't get cocky. It? This isn't a training op. Right. So what exactly is this wonderful mission? Well, about two years ago, a certain Soviet scientist requested asylum in the West through one of our moles. His name is Nikolai Stepanovich Sokolov. He's head of the OKB754 Design Bureau, one of the Soviet's top secret weapon research facilities, and the East's foremost expert on weapons development. Uh -huh. Sokolov, isn't he that famous rocket scientist? What is he, some kind of rocket scientist? On April the 12th, 1961, the Soviets achieved the first manned space flight in history. Yes, the Earth was blue, but there was no God. Well spoken. There was no God. The rocket that carried Yuri Gagarin into orbit was the A-1, known as the Vostok rocket. Sokolov is said to be the man most responsible for the multi-engine cluster used in that rocket. Engine cluster. Fuck, After Gagarin's like, flight, Sokolov left rocket development to become the head of the newly established Design Bureau. From a lowly technician to head of a Design Bureau, that's quite a success story. So why do you want to defect? It seems he'd become afraid of his own creations. Afraid? Call it a crisis of conscience. <laughs> and for that, he left his country and his this family behind and went that's over the That's how the Cold War was, though. Not exactly. <laughs> One of his conditions that. was that his Russians, family Russians, was Russians, also Russians, to Russians. be taken safely to the West. We used a mole to get the family out first, and succeeded in sneaking Sokolov over the Berlin Wall shortly afterwards. I'm just looking forward to I this supposed uh, musical the operation. Um, interlude we're going to get The security there, on the eastern side was still full of holes back then. Then what? We got Sokolov over in one piece, but the whole ordeal had left him exhausted, and we checked him into a hospital in West Berlin. I'll bet. It took him two weeks and more than 600 miles to get from the research facility in the Soviet Union to Berlin. He was in no condition to say anything coherent. He was just was going, only <laughs> a week later <laughs> that we had <laughs> about <laughs> on our for about four hours. The Cuban Missile out. Crisis. October the 16th, 1962. President Kennedy received word that the Soviets were in the process of deploying intermediate range ballistic missiles in Cuba. They uh, got it to me in this range the in Cuba. Dismantle and remove the missiles. At the same time, he announced a naval blockade to prevent further missile shipments from reaching Cuba. But the Soviets didn't back down, instead placing their armed forces on secondary alert. No, no, Khrushchev Soviet didn't back down at all. Missiles continued on course towards Cuba. U.S. and Soviet forces went on alert for an all-out nuclear war. Frantic negotiations were conducted through the UN's Emergency Security Council and unofficial channels to end the hair-trigger standoff. And the X-Men got involved. Finally, on October the 28th, 
the Soviet Union agreed to remove its missiles from Cuba. <laughs> and so the world avoided Thank a nuclear Chris. holocaust. <laughs> but in order to get the Soviets to pull their missiles out, we had to make a deal. Well, the Soviets had to pull something else out, too. You to know what I mean? IRBMs from Turkey. No. The Jupiter IRBMs deployed in Turkey were obsolete. And we were going to get rid uh, of them anyway. They turned out to be obsolete. no strategic value whatsoever to either the US or the Russians. The Turkey deal was a ruse, a cover story that was fed to the other intelligence agencies around the world. So what did the Russians really want? Sokolov. They wanted us to return Sokolov. You mean the Soviets they pulled out of five Cuba just to dollars, get their hands on Sokolov? enough to fund their military for 16 That's years. That's right. What the hell was he working on? At the time, we had no idea. We were running out of time. It was either give up Sokolov or risk full-scale nuclear war. In the end, we had no choice. I have no President choice. President Kennedy gave in to Khrushchev's demand. The next day, I got Sokolov out of the hospital, handing him over to agents on the eastern side. Sokolov kept on screaming, save me, until he disappeared from my sight. I mean... Then a month ago, we received some new information from one of our moles. About Sokolov? About Sokolov. Yes. He was taken back to the I'm research sleep. facility and forced to continue working on the weapon in question under KGB supervision. What's more, it's on the verge of completion. So what kind of weapon is it? Something to do with space rockets? Space no. rockets? Missiles. Same technology. Snake, you're an idiot. I guess you're right. We don't know the details, but it appears to be a new kind of nuclear device. Uh. For half a year now, the Soviets have been conducting frequent nuclear tests at Semipalatinsk. Something to do with you the weapon, made that I assume. Up. We're talking about a secret weapon so big that Khrushchev was ready to pull out of Cuba to get it back. Is Sokolov still in the facility? No. According to our intelligence, he's in Selino Yask. You made that up too. About three miles to the west, that's known as the Virgin Cliffs. Because it's the never Virgin been laid, Cliffs. apparently. Nice name for a virtuous mission. Oh. They moved him there just recently. Why? Some kind of medical. Apparently, gear. they're conducting a field test of the weapon, but it's our best chance to get him back. This mission would never have been possible if he was still in the research facility. You might say it was a mission impossible? This is our last chance. Sokolov must have known that, too, when he contacted us. Listen up, Jack. Your mission is to infiltrate Selino Yask in the Soviet mountains, ensure the safety of Sokolov, and bring him back to the West. Sokolov back before that weapon is complete, we'll be facing a major crisis. A Cuban missile the crisis is ticking. A second one, maybe? Once we've confirmed the rescue of Sokolov, stand by at the recovery point. A recovery balloon will be dropped at that point. Helium will be pumped into the balloon to inflate it. The process that takes has, about 20 that minutes. That will happen, yeah, that's how that works. That's how helium Once works. Once it's complete, the gunship's <laughs> arm will latch onto the balloon and pull it up. The Fulton surface to air recovery system. Excited? I'm familiar yeah, sure. with the theory. Take it easy. It's been combat proof. Do you think Sokolov is up to it? The shock will be less than during a parachute jump, and the arm can handle up to 500 pounds. So you're planning on going over the border in a single combat talent? She's equipped with two six-barrel 20mm Vulcan cannons, as well as two 40mm machine guns. You know, that would guns. make sense. Also, hey there. It sounds like she could hold her own against a battalion of tanks. Even with the fuel in the reserve tank, we're facing a four-hour time limit. Thing do you if want all to goes do? well, it shouldn't take more than a few hours. Home in time for dinner. But you if fucking anything wish, goes wrong, thing. You'll be eating dinner, breakfast, and all the rest of your meals in the jungle. Welcome to the jungle!
play? Tree! Tree! Cliff! Aww. And here I was hope thinking that the game was going to be like a 20 minute cutscene and then Snake dies and all things end. <laughs> the basics, yes. Knife, gun, knife, gun. The Savage Land. Wait. Look at my dramatic face reveal. Aren't I awesome? And David Hayter as Snake. 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 Chris. Yes, I'm here too. Do you copy? You're already in enemy territory, and somebody might be listening in. From here oh on out, we'll be using code names to refer to each other. Your code name for this mission will be Naked Snake. Oh, I'll be gosh. referring to you as Snake from now on. So then what's the You're point of the naked? You're not to mention your real name. Snake? Snake. Well, you don't like snakes? What do you mean? Everybody You've eaten one like before, snakes. haven't you? In survival training. Gross. <laughs> I'm glad to hear that. Are you? I don't know if I'd ever order one in a restaurant, but... Be careful. You might not have a choice. What about you, Major? Mother of what God. What should I call you? Hmm. Let's see. I'll be... Here we go. I'll be Tom. Call oh, me Major no, Tom. fuck you. No, no. This will be fuck a sneaky you, game. mission. Up yours. You must not be seen by the Ground enemy. Ground control to Major Tom. Go fuck your yourself. Presence. Is that clear? This kind of infiltration is the Fox God, unit's speciality. In God. other words, weapons and equipment to procure on site. Oh. That goes for food as well. You're completely naked, just as your name implies. Great. So carry your now balls I see in your why hand. Asked me if I like snakes. I suppose calling me Snake was your idea of a joke too. No. There's a good reason for that. Uh, we'll tell you later when the time is right. Gotcha. Why is the time wrong Getting back now? to the subject, how exactly am I supposed to feed myself? You've been issued a knife and a tranquilizer gun. Swear to Use God. them to hunt for food. You'll also find some medical supplies in your backpack. Yeah, about the backpack. I lost it in a tree on the way down. Lost your mom in the tree, what? I see. Well, you'd better go back and get it then. You know where it is? No problem. I can see it from here. It's stuck on a branch. Uh, I feel like I should to be climb a tree, stand in down. front of a tree that's covered in ivy and press the action button. I'll be monitoring your progress over the radio. We can't risk violating Soviet airspace, but I'll be in the gunship. Uh, My frequency is 140.85. I'll give you a, a call pen. if I need to talk to you. If you need to talk to me, use the send function. Okay, Snake. Go get your backpack. Good thing I had a pen close by. Oh, my God. All right, 140.85. Also, things are written on this piece of paper. No, that's not going to work. <laughs> 140.85. Okay, there we go. Ah. Uh. Oh wait, is this percentage my my camouflage percentage? Huh. Alright, well this is our tutorial area apparently. I don't seem to have an objective marker. Oh, okay, how much I stand out. Alright, yep. Ah, uh, no objective marker, so I actually have to find this thing. Uh, he likes to default to putting his back to stuff. I don't know how the Major Tom reference could be any worse than, than the obvious Bowie reference.
Oh, it's gotta be this tree here, doesn't it? Yeah, it is. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> no, 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 Pokey. It's not. It, it's not a matter of protecting the sweet sussy ass. It's per protecting the dummy thick ass that's gonna slap. Wait. No, I don't want to go back down. Wait, what? Okay. Okay, so... Now what? Oh. It was doing... Oh, okay, it was just to do that. Alright, I thought I had to go higher. I see you've retrieved your backpack, Snake. Oh, don't be so sure, Chris. To equip a weapon, it's necessary to take it out of your backpack. In the survival viewer, choose weapon from the backpack. I've, I've watched Your available uh, weapons will be displayed a in a window in the upper left. From that list, choose the weapon you want to equip and press the enter button. For other equipped items, just do the same thing from item. Got it. Right. Use the survival viewer backpack. Use yep, the survival right. viewer backpack. Survival is fundamental to this mission. It's fun with After mentors. you've been out in the field for a while, your stamina will start to drop. If your stamina gets too low, it'll affect your performance. You won't be able to shoot accurately, for example, and your wounds won't heal as smoothly. Great. Keep an eye on your stamina so you don't run out. To recover lost stamina, you can hunt for local flora and fauna. Oh, great. You can it's use either your tranquilizer gun or your knife to hunt. My only weapon is a Mark 22 Hush Puppy tranquilizer gun. That's right. Oh, no. It's been fitted with its own suppressor. I'll bet. However, the suppressor will deteriorate every time you fire. Of course it Once will. Once its durability reaches zero, the noise suppression effect will be gone. So don't get too trigger happy with it. The suppressor's durability is shown me, in the icon. Any weapons and equipment beyond what you're carrying now, you'll have to find as you go. I have to I find my own weapons and asshole. equipment. Whose crazy idea was this anyway? Hideo Solo covert actions are standard Fox operating procedure. You can't leave any traces of your presence. No weapons, equipment, footprints, sweat, or bodily waste. No the shit. Same goes for bullets and cartridges, too. Your presence in enemy territory is already a violation of international conventions of warfare. There aren't supposed to be any American soldiers in Russia. It could spark an international incident. You don't say. You can't let anyone see you. You can't let the enemy know you're there. This is a stealth mission. You're Welcome a ghost to a snake stealth game. Every sense of the word. Being played There'll by be a guy no who's not. If you're captured. Uh, traditionally the military and U.S. government will deny um, any involvement stealth. in the affair. Then I'll just have to take care of myself, huh? I'm gonna I'm die. I'm afraid a lot. so. You've been given a fake death pill for that purpose. What? SIS guidelines stipulate that soldiers on covert ops like this one be issued a potassium cyanide capsule. Mm, potassium. Take it to your body so you can take it part. when you need to. How generous of you. Use it if you're taken prisoner by the enemy. It'll send you into a state of false death for a short time. Fooling them into thinking that I'm really dead. So, how do I come back to life? That's right, Just Polky. take the no revival pill. If you, kill everyone. you mean that thing they put in my tooth before the mission? That's the one. But be careful. If you remain in a state of false death for too long, nothing will be able to bring you back. Remember that. I'll keep it in mind. You said this was a solo mission, right? Except right. for the 30 other people. I guess that, that means I can't count on any reinforcements. Correct. The mission rests entirely in your hands. Uh, a real one man army. Relax. Right. There's a support team ready to back you up over the radio. Yeah, Who? Nothing else. I'll introduce them to you. This time, oh. survival is of utmost importance. going to be what says, Mr. and Mrs. O'Christ. Oh the first Christ, member of the support team will be in charge of monitoring your physical condition, oh, different game. acting as a medic, so to speak, as well as recording your mission data. She's a member of Fox as well, and she's here on the gunship with Oh, me. someone might call her a she... foxy lady? Hello, Snake. I'm paramedic. Nice to meet you. Paramedic. As in a medic who comes in by Fuck parachute. Fuck you, game. Aren't you going to tell me your real name? Are you going to tell me yours, Mr. Snake? My name, huh? It's John Doe. And they paramedic. call you Jack for short. You're a regular Captain Nemo. A name means nothing on the battlefield. After a week, no All one right, has take a it name. Easy, Chris. What's your name? Jane Doe. Very funny. I wasn't joking, but I'll tell you my name only if you manage to make it back alive. 
My frequency is 145.73. She's also in charge of recording your mission data. Whenever you want to save, send a message over the reserved save frequency. 140.96. Uh, so fuck, saving fuck lets sake, me what? record my mission <laughs> data. That's right. It also records the state of your health. Save. Good to know. Okay, I got it. There's one more person I want to introduce you to, Snake. Huh? Speaking of snakes, you remember the boss, don't you? Only A legendary soldier one. and your mentor. Actually, it was the boss that got the DCI's authorization in the first place. She's going to be serving as Fox's mission advisor. The boss is? She also helped me plan this the mission. Boss is a she in this she and I were at SAS together. Jack, is that you? How many years has it been? Boss? That's right. It's me. It's me, it's me, it's oh. DDP. Talk to me. Let me hear your voice. I'm Snake. It's been five years, 72 days, and 18 hours. Whoa! You've lost Stalker weight. alert. You can tell just by the sound of my voice. Of course I can. I know all about you. You used to be 600 really? pounds. Well, I don't know anything about you. What's that supposed to mean? Why'd you disappear on me all of a sudden? I was on a top secret mission. Hmm. But you left your you underwear behind. You didn't need me anymore. What? But there were still so many things I wanted you to teach me. No, I taught you everything you needed to know about fighting techniques. That wasn't I taught you I all meant. I could. The rest you needed to learn on your own. Techniques, sure. But what about how to think like a soldier? How to think like a soldier? I can't teach you that. A soldier needs to be strong in spirit, body, and technique. What is happening right And now? the only thing you can learn from someone else is technique. In uh. fact, technique doesn't even matter. What's most important is spirit. Spirit and body are like two sides of a single coin. They're the same thing. I can't teach you how to think. You'll just have to figure it out for yourself. I'll Listen make sure to me, to take Jack. My, uh, plus just because soldiers for, are on the same mission. side right now doesn't mean they always will be. Having I'm personal going to be feelings you. about your comrades is one of the worst sins you can commit. Politics determine who you face on the battlefield. And politics are a living thing. They change along with the times. Yesterday's uh, good might be tomorrow's evil. Is that why you no abandoned comment. me? No, it had nothing to do with you. I already told Are you, Jack. Really doing this I was on a top, the, secret the mission. on a top secret mission. A soldier mission, has to follow asshole. whatever orders he's given. It's not his place to question why. Ugh. But you're looking for a reason to fight. You're a natural-born fighter. But you're not quite a soldier. A soldier is a political tool, nothing more. That's doubly true if he's a and career soldier. you need to calm soldier. that rocket in your pants right, right and wrong now, Snake, have no place in his mission. He has no enemies and no friends. Only the mission. You follow the orders you're given. That's what being a soldier is. I do whatever I have to to get the job done. I don't think about politics. That's not the same thing. Sooner or later, your conscience is going to bother you. In the end, you Jokes have to choose you. whether you're going to live as a soldier or just another man with a gun. The man There's a saying with the in the golden Orient, gun. Loyalty to the end. Do you know what it means? Being patriotic. Hey, it means so. devoting yep. yourself to your MGS. country. I follow the president and the top brass. I'm ready to die for them if necessary. The president Especially and the top Steve. brass won't be there Everybody forever. Would be willing Once to their die terms are up, others will take their place. I follow the will of the leader, no matter who's in charge. Surprise! People are the ones who Hitler's in charge now. Now what? Then who does? Answer quick. The times. People's values change over time, and so do the leaders of a country. So there's no such thing as an enemy in absolute terms. The oh enemies God. we fight are only Kojima, enemies get off in the relative damn terms, with this. constantly changing with the times. You ain't gotta convince anybody. As long as we have loyalty to the end, there's no point in believing in anything, even in those we love. And that's the way a soldier's supposed to think. The only thing we can believe in with absolute certainty is the mission, Jack. <laughs> All right, but do me a favor. What is I it? I want to graduate Call to Trousers. Snake. Snake. Oh, right. Your code name is Snake. It suits you well. That's right. The legendary unit that the boss put together during World War II but was I a snake. The, legendary unit. the Cobra oh, unit. Means something a group else. of heroes that brought the war to an end and saved the world. As long Cobra. as you've got a legendary hero backing you up, you'll be fine. Isn't that right, Snake? The legendary yeah. hero. I can't think of anyone else I'd rather have with me. 
Oh, and one more thing, boss. Yes? It's good to hear your voice again. I'm gonna go Same here. Uh, around the back After of this all, tree for a minute. Who knows if, if either mind. of us will make it out alive? Snake? Well, you're, you're not always here at the best moment, at urban are you? warfare and infiltrating buildings. But this is the jungle. Survival is Once going again, to be key. Welcome to the jungle! Those CQC techniques I taught you are sure to come in handy. CQC? Close quarters combat, huh? I've it been in the Green Berets for the past few years. I'm probably pretty rusty. The, the, Not to worry. The, 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 I'll be here to like help a soldier, but he's been in the Green After Berets. All, this is your first actual survival mission. I'll be supporting uh. you over the radio. Where are you, boss? Next to the Major? The boss is communicating with us by radio from aboard a permit-class submarine in the Arctic Ocean. You know, considering my that we're giving each other is code... My frequency 141.80. Call me if you need my advice on battle techniques. Gotcha. Your mission is to retrieve Dr. Sokolov. Dr. Sokolov is being held in an abandoned factory I'm getting located ahead. to the north of your it's current It's already position. happening. Avoid heavy combat and don't let anyone see you. Don't forget that this is a stealth mission. I don't believe you. Snake, try to remember some of the basics of CQC. So where's this, uh, where's this music-based opening that I'm supposed to get? It's supposed to be, supposedly worth the, the price Commencing of the mission. Commencing virtuous mission now. Because it's not right now. Oh, let's see. Boy, that's sure a way he's holding things, isn't it? He looks disinterested. Alright. It didn't actually tell me how to use these things. All right, that's crouch. Uh -huh. Oh, we've got the cigar. That's nice to know. It's X to aim, release to fire. Attach suppressor with A. Soon? Ah, uh, how soon? X to slash, L to stab. All right, we're going with knife. Okay, this is not what I expected, but sure. All right, so we go first person. All right, double, double A button to crawl. Loving an alligator! Wait, that's not how the song goes. Uh. Uh. Um. Well, I died. Okay. Sure, I guess. So I guess we don't go that way, huh? Well, I hope that this isn't going to be like Battle Toads. 608 deaths would be a lot. I, I don't know where I'm going, though. This is the problem I have right now. Whoop! Grenade? What did that mean? Is there supposedly a grenade there? Yeah, no one will ever know I was there. So I'm dead. All right, we snuck out of there. We avoided the gators after they, you know, hit me.
time for more exposition and talking on the radio. All right. Major, I've spotted two enemy soldiers. They're probably KGB troops sent to guard Sokolov. Right. AK-47s and grenades. Stuff I want. Snake, your presence in Soviet territory is already a violation of international law. You can't let the Kremlin find out that the CIA law. and the American Frickin government scar. are involved. Get Contact you with the enemy is strictly prohibited. Don't engage them in battle either. This is a stealth mission. Got that? I got the it. The major I got is it. right. The point of this mission is to sneak through the jungle without being seen. The success of the mission depends on how well you use your camouflage. Uh. Change your camouflage by selecting How Camouflage from the Survival seen. Viewer. The Uniform option lets you pick your uniform, while the Face option lets you change your face paint. Choosing camouflage that blends in with your surroundings will help you conceal yourself more effectively. Also, don't forget that anything that moves will stand out in the jungle. Well, if you, you just say. stand up and run around like an idiot, you're bound to be spotted. Challenge but if you crawl accepted. instead, you should be able to sneak by without being noticed. Mm. You're boring. You can see how effective your camouflage is by looking at the camo index. The camo index shows how well your current camouflage blends in with the surrounding area. The higher the value, the harder you are to spot, and vice versa. The key she is to make so yourself cool. one with nature. Keep that in mind as you go along, okay? Uh. Pops up. Okay. All right. So Leaf Woodland. All right, this makes sense, right? 50%. That's what I'm talking about now. Where were those dudes? They were over there. Oh, good. It's actually letting me crawl from outside. Oh, hey. I got an achievement. I could totally see you. Achieve a camouflage index of 90%. Go me. Okay. So I feel like I need to wait for this guy to turn around, bright eyes. I would assume, at least. I just realize I'm sticking out part of the way. He's probably going to see me. This is stupid. I'm probably going to get caught. Maybe not. Well, this guy was just clueless enough to not notice me. Here's the other guy.
tree, tree, tree. Oh, that was a, I picked up a grenade. Okay, so. Uh, let's see, woodland is still right. Okay, he is out there. I don't think this is actually working as well as I hoped. Yeah, 55% is much, much better. He's going to see me, isn't he? I'm totally going to be seen, aren't I? Don't you look at me. Ooh. Come on, snake, move it. Okay, there's a third dude. <clears throat> High quality guarding, right? Am I going left or right here? Jump button? I'm not actually sure what the jump button is. But yeah, the real problem is, am I going right or left? Because I don't know, it doesn't exactly give me an objective marker. What the fuck is going on? Why is he going backwards? Not that I'm complaining too much, it did get me here. Okay, there he is. I just hope to get out of the first area without dying too many times. I guess best 
Yes. Wait, he just turned around. Why did he turn around? Yeah, it's this way, Snake. Shake that ass, Snake. I think I'm past them. Whoop, whoop. Okay, I do see a guy there. I figure we go towards where the where the bullshit is. Where the morons are. Yeah, the 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 dummy, the dummy thick, yeah. You know, I once saw a documentary about velociraptors that said never go into the long grass. Uh, I wish I knew a little bit more about this. I, I mean, I really, as much as anything, I wish I had a freaking objective marker. It's not really asking that much, I don't think. But no! That's not tactical espionage action. I just really hope I'm going in the right direction because this is ridiculous. That's promising. The letterbox is usually meant uh, area change. Oh, hey, I made it. I assume. Now what? Oh no. Did I go backwards? My god, I think I went backwards. Damn it. So I guess I should have gone left, huh? Uh. 
Okay. We're back here, at least. Oh my god, I can't believe I went backwards. Of all the freaking things. That is positively the worst thing that could have happened. Short of getting caught, of course. Look at the map. Yep, I guess I should have done that in the first place. I guess I got good practice. Oh no, not the bees! Not the bees! Okay, so I'm shooting this down, apparently. Oh, I guess that'll happen. Yeah, that's probably a good thing, but there just straight up bored not expecting anything yeah that's um really not the greatest um thing in the world there didn't really give me a <coughs> aiming so much What's wrong? Nothing. How do I get to first person outside of crawling? You saw nothing. Who's that? Who's that? Radio! Radio backup! HQ spawn! This is HQ. Well. Oh, just fall off and die. That was apparently what I needed to do. Okay, now... Um... The hell we got here?
Oh. Uh, I don't see that beehive from where I'm at. Oh, now I do. Huh? Use bees! Ointment? Well, that's, I guess, one way. No, not the bees! Not the bees! Ah! Indeed. Also high. Okay, they all fucked off. And now it's time for me to fuck off. Major, I've reached the abandoned factory where Sokolov is supposedly being held. This place is a dump. I can't see Sokolov from here. The security is pretty tight. There are sentries posted around the perimeter. I wonder how many are inside. I think the answer to that is yes. Yes. Your objective, Sokolov, is inside the factory. They should be holding him in a room in the northeast section. Northeast section. Got it. Be Got careful. It. Your mission is to bring Sokolov back alive. Is he must so. not be exposed to any kind of danger. Do not approach Sokolov while in the alert phase. Nah. Right. Oh, right. and one more thing, Snake. You mean there's more? There's always more. No, it's more. just that when you get to Sokolov, <laughs> I want you to tell him something from me. And that is? Sorry for being so late. <laughs> is that all? Yes. Understood. Beginning my approach to the target. Yeah, hang on a second there. Let's see, I gotta alt tab that. I need to make a slight adjustment. Right. There we go. You should be able to see well enough. Am, am I? Oh, right, because the um, when the game went silly on me, it crashed my side stream. Nope. I have woodcut and potty. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Uh, well, at least now you have an objective. Yeah, still no actual direction. Now to put all this DVD survivor training to good use. That was a generator. Yeah. Uh, probably in the back somewhere. Yeah, I'm right there. Okay, this will do nicely for the moment. I'm guessing I need to just kind of head in the front there, huh? I hope. If you're the sneaky disease, does that mean you do your Ouroboros? All the Ouroboros. Yes. Now maybe the front's a little too obvious. There's bound to be a side entrance, and this, this half-blown wall here suggests such. Yeah, it's the Steam version. Keep walking.
The reason he was called Snake is that he crawled on his front, on his front the whole way through. Yeah, I believe that. Hey, okay. other floor. Yeah, what do you know? The size of that ass was not too big to squeeze in there. This is all f fine and well until we have freaking bear traps. Oh, hi, Snake. Oh, hi, Mouse. Oh, hi, Mark. <laughs> I have no idea where I'm going. That's the worst part right now. Now I'm out the back. Ah, uh, yes, the snake finally switched through the back door. Act casual. Yep, as you do. Okay, this is definitely not the way I needed to go. Alright, so... If that's not the way to go... Well, this looks promising. Possibly. Who's that? Well, this is HQ. My God, it takes me a while to die, doesn't it? All right, guess I'll get a look at the freaking. Uh, This has a lot more HP than I uh, gave credit for. It. <laughs> I have scoped them to death. Yeah. Oh my god, how do things work? <laughs> what? What? How do I fix this? Oh my god. Snake, do you read? Snake! Major. Snake, are you alright? Yeah, I'm okay. You're far from okay. Look at your life gauge. This is terrible. You're on your last leg. No, I, I just... I can still... I just want to restart See? from the beginning. Snake, this is a solo sneaking mission. Do you know what that means? Yeah. No, you don't. Uh, huh? It means there's I'm no backup, here. no cavalry. If you're taken out, nobody is there to take your place. Uh, Pull out for now and recuperate. Find a hiding place and get some rest. Your life gauge will gradually recover with time. But the speed of your life gauge recovery depends on the level of your stamina gauge. So get plenty to eat and get some rest. You hear what the me? Fuck even. Do you hear me? I hear you. I'm I can't get away. Oh, I That was fucking horrible. Oh yeah, alert's not over yet. Oh, I see it. Come on. 
Really? I can't just restart the freaking... From the... From the freaking... Oh my god! Finally! That took way too long! The bullet sponge. And you can uh, learn how to. There's this guy facing back and forth. You're back in the bridge. That's fine, at least they won't notice me here. Oh, no, wait, that's the radio. Got food? I got calorie mate. And I got a hornet's nest. Not eaten yet. Taste unknown. What? Taste unknown. Yeah. So, so, sometimes you can't get some kind of food that you don't know the Much taste of more. it. It's unbelievably tasty. Yeah, crouch down and lay on your front, that's, and after a while your health's gonna start recovering. Alright. Yep. Yeah. Welcome to the regeneration system. Oh, yeah, I haven't even actually done a save yet. Yeah, that might be a good idea at some point. Um, one other little thing here that I might have noted while you're crawling down that other side, you see rats and the snakes. You can't take a stab at them with your knife and actually collect them for food. All of the fauna yeah. of the little animals, you can't actually kill them and get the food out of them. But you know, the, the, the whole theme of this game here was all about survival! Mm, yeah, huh? Kidding. Also, uh, whenever you get some any kind of food, you can also, uh, I believe you can ask one of them here and they'll actually ask you how well this, what kind of food this is, and uh, the very important question of, well, how well does it taste? Mm -hmm. mm, delicious, delicious hornets. Ah, yes. Yeah, I can't wait. A large influx of bees ought to put a stop to that. He is like just turned a horn in its nest on that one. Mm-hmm. <sighs> okay, now let's see if we can't get ourselves a save. Yeah. Um, if you press down you actually see all of the names of all the people that you have a contact for. Ah. Saving the game, Snake? A lot faster! It would be mighty handy. There hey, we Snake? Go. Godzilla. Also, apparently, I turned off the uh, voice acting. Wait, what? I hit B, oh. and I guess it turned off the voices. The heck? Oh, that's sad. What? Does every what? Why does Godzilla have to, have to do with his pants being tight? What? Oh, my God. They made an American version too, yeah, huh? Yep. <laughs> Jesus. Well. What? Uh huh. Everybody does love Godzilla. Sure do. What the hell? Yeah, um, whenever you go to, to a new area, usually here, and you try to go safe, 
you should, should, should be taking a look at a different movie. Of the time, of course. I'm still baffled by how apparently hitting the B button cancelled the, uh, the voice yeah, acting. Know, that doesn't even make sense. It's weird. He's a little weird, my friend, mon ami. See, set me off. Alright. Now, I still think I had the right... Huh? You've got to be that? kidding me! Uh, no, right now, no, you're going to be kidding me, huh? there's no way... Who's that? Ah! What happened? Just aim at him with your gun and shoot. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do, and it's it's not letting me do it. Patrol here. Alright, well, let's do this. I, I legitimately cannot believe that you can't just quit to last checkpoint. Those were the times. It was the PS2. Oh. Yeah, that's back to the other, the other side of the bridge, so yeah. Let's go back up that path. Oh yeah, health has not recovered. Yeah, that's the problem. I'm like, what? Why? Just when it saved, it saved oh. your stamina at the beginning of that. Whoops. Who said what's wrong? What the hell? What? Who was that? Who's that? <coughs> Radio, call <coughs> HQ! <coughs> what the hell? It's like he went right to me. It, it it's like it it doesn't reset things to what they were before. Hmm. You might need to recover your health first, switch to a different area, then make another save. That probably save your your health from your health point. Yeah, but I'm surrounded by dudes. You'll always be surrounded by dudes. Welcome to enemy territory. Yeah, those Get guys down. immediately converged on me. Where it's, it's it's like the alert can't be undone. Also, one of us probably you couldn't go to first person and shoot him from there. What, shoot the dude here? Hey, you could do that from uh, your position in the fashion. 
Even when you were laying on the ground. Hold the shoe button. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, if you want them to go down sleep right away, shoot them in the head. Yeah. How do I reload, though? Or is this all the bullets I have? No, it can't be. No, you... You have about 70 bullets, I think? Yeah, 70 bullets, 81 is your max. The, bu the bullets in your gun are the bottom. It's not bad. Um... If you want to reload, press your your L1 twice quickly. That'll unequip and re-equip it. No, it's not L1. L2 then? Nope. That gave me the scope. Oh! R2! R2, your weapon is shot. There you go. Oh, that's the reload? Okay. Yeah. yeah. Tapping quickly will unequip something, tapping quickly will re-equip it. So when you do that, you'll reload your, your ammo. Alright, here we go again. Here we go again. What's wrong? What is the wrong? Come on, buddy, show up. Yeah, seriously. Whenever you're coming, the snake knows. Here he comes. Bright side is nobody seeing you, the alarm will go out real quick. Yep. Also, um, okay. Nothing to see here. Nothing wrong. Just a snake. A sneaky snake. Sneaky, sneaky snake. snake. A snake that is sneaky. You saw nothing, fucko. Don't make me have to right press and hold the X button. I'll do it. Uh -huh. You can. He'll just be taking a nap. Your little cat nap. We're really, really be proud. I think I saw something. No, you didn't. You saw nothing? Damn right you are. You sure also, are. You're Russian. You're speaking pretty good American type English for Russian. Sure are. What does that mean something? You know what it means? It means something is sus. Yes. Well, then, then again, you are sus, so yes. Alright, get under the thing. Yep. Okay, yes, this is a... Uh... This is progress. Step forward. Yes.
Oh, brother. <clears throat> also, nice ammo count. Yeah, it is, isn't it? <laughs> huh? Are those footsteps? Uh oh. Who's that? What's going on? Ah! Why is this aiming this way? I guess this is one way. Indeed. That'll do. That'll do. Yeah. Alert! They know where you are. They're gonna be aiming for you. Invasion. They don't know where you are, but it's just aware. I wish I knew where to go. Inside the building. Yeah, but where? That is a good question. Patrol here. We've lost sight of the enemy. Commence alert formation. Acknowledged. The enemy is still nearby. Pursue and engage him. Huh. Yeah, about that. <sighs> so we're just gonna wait no. for this to count down, apparently. Seemingly. Oh, those two are asleep there. Three. News in a way. So how's everybody uh, we'll doing see. tonight? <laughs> I ain't moving till this is gone. <laughs> I will say my knowledge about the Middle Gear Solid 3 isn't that great. I've played the game once. But I still don't know it, and I did play through Metal Gear Solid 1, 2, 3, and 4. Not 5, though. Well, a lot of mechanics. Well, this should dro start really dropping significantly at some point, I would think.
but you need kind of take care of the two of their guys. I'm surprised they haven't come by to wake them up. You know what, though? Who cares? They're supervisors, but then again, you don't care. Nope. My health is full. Getting some of those snacks or those rats might not be a bad idea once you're down under again. Yeah, tab at him. I, I'd like to get that. Come mm -hmm. okay, on now. Seven, six, five, four. Three, Three, two, two one. And Happy New Year! HQ. This is HQ. Patrol here. Unable to locate the problem. Understood. Resume your patrol. Now they're awake. What's wrong? I just needed a nap, boss. What's wrong? Good grief. I need a break. Okay, well, three guys fucked off. Probably some of the extra enforcement they had. You can only have so many enforcers around the place. True facts. Better than video game limitations. Okay. Once more with feeling. Want to get to this freaking uh, supposed amazing intro sequence? Uh huh. Hopefully, we get that tonight. Better. Snake. Snake. I'm not telling you to get up, dude. He has some problem with collisions. Oh, he'll feel like walls. Okay, sir, but first. Dummy thick thighs again. Indeed. Yet somehow the nuts alerted. Don't care. I caution anything. Hey, snake. Huh. Our Snake H. Indeed. Our rat. Our rat. Now, a nifty little feature about the food in this game is that it actually does get bad if you leave them in your inventory for too long. Oh, well. Wow. You're able to catch them live to make them last longer, but still, food is food. Right. Standing the bar could use it. Oh, I see another one of those frog things over there. Mm. And by frog, we mean a big guy with a rifle, eh? Mm-hmm. Well, on the bright side, it camouflages 90%, so... I think this is the guy I may have mistakenly alerted originally. Started the whole fiasco. Possibly.
I'm go somewhere else. Nothing to see here. Just a <laughs> blade of grass. Yes, let's see some Arachian. <laughs> the puns, they don't take a break. Nope. Can't stop, won't stop. Will you please, kind sir, fuck off. Seriously? <laughs> Who did this pipe for who had so much waiting? Uh. He does not want to get away. You might have to uh, sing him a lullaby. Won't even see it coming. True. Just be taking nappy nap. <laughs> there we go. That worked. He'll basically stay out until somebody freaking kicks him awake, eh? Um, he w he'll be asleep for a long time, but after a little while, the longer he stays asleep, the more Z's will disappear from the top of his head. What's that? No more Z's. Ah, oh, come on! So I still don't know where I'm going in all this. Wait, wait, I know why you I know why you don't have it in your inventory. You need to equip for Altar with your backpack. That's why you don't have your grenades either. Oh well not not this. Yeah, that's why. Okay. That's if you want to, that's what's in the backpack right now. You want to take anything out. Go to your weapons. You took out that uh, weapon, that means. There you go. Okay, there we go. Now remember, you do not have a suppressor that fits that big thing. This is HQ. Not worried about it at this stage. Here. We've lost sight of the enemy. 
Commence alert formation. But where am I going? Knowledge. The enemy is still nearby. Pursue I believe there's a room that you should be able to get into. There should be a door. Yeah, I'm sure of that, but I don't think it's up the stairs. Nope, because you're in there earlier. Yeah. Left? But left is the exit, that's how I got here. No, uh, the way you were pointing with the screen. Behind me. Yeah, to your left from there. Actually. Okay. High corner. I believe that's how you should go. Here, maybe. A door. Alright, well, it wasn't quite the way I meant to get there, but I got there. Thank God. That was a real bastard and a half. <laughs> you must be so glad. You must be so. Are you one of Vulcan's men? You'll never get it from me. No. I'm a CIA agent. I've come to escort you back to the other side of the Iron Curtain. Your CIA? Yeah. I was sent by Major Zero, the man who got you out two Ground years ago. Called Major Zero. <laughs> Zero. I have a message from him. What is it? A worthless he one. He said to tell you sorry for being so late. <laughs> Did he now? What does it mean? It means he should it have been It means here. he's a man of his word. Right. But we've got no well. time for this. You have to get me out of here before they arrive. No escort quests. Who's they? <laughs> Colonel Vulcan of Groom. You in the West know him as Thunderbolt. Thaddeus Thunderbolt Ross? Thunderbolt? Indeed. Never heard of him. Turn is real red. He's a member of the Army's extremist faction. Oh, here the we man go. who seeks to seize control of the motherland. Ever since the Cuban Missile Crisis two years ago, Khrushchev has been pursuing a policy of peaceful coexistence with the West. Despite resistance and criticism from hawks in the army and the provincial authorities, Khrushchev has managed to suppress the opposition so far. But the failure of his agricultural policies has put him in a precarious position. And on top of that, the tragedy last November. President Kennedy's assassination. Right. Precisely. Which supposedly you in guys did. Khrushchev has lost his biggest partner and his power base is rapidly crumbling away. A certain group is plotting to use this opportunity to seize power by rallying the anti-government forces, overthrowing Khrushchev, and installing Brezhnev and Kosygin in his place. The mastermind behind this plot is Colonel Volgin of the Gru. He has control over another secret weapons research facility much like this one, OKB-812, known as the Granin Design Bureau, and is using it to further his plans. But that is not enough to satisfy him. Now he's plotting to seize the secret weapon I have been developing here and use it as leverage in his bid for power. Power! I suppose that se secret weapon may be something called... The intelligence says that they are going to make their move during the test. Then Possible. the soldiers outside... Exactly. They wouldn't need that many men just to keep me inside. Their orders were to prevent Colonel Volgin from capturing me. Even if it meant killing me in the process, or so it would seem. Uh -oh. Volgin will come. I'm sure of it. You must get me out of here before then. How do you then? know he's not coming right now? Leave it to me. Oh my! By the way, 
Your Russian is superb. No Russian. Where did you learn to speak it? From my mentor. Is that so? America is truly a frightening country. No, you're not wrong, pal. Having second thoughts. No kidding. No. I have no love for this place. Let's go. Major, this is Snake. Sokolov is safe with me. He's doing fine. No injuries. Good work, Snake. Now hurry up and get Sokolov to the recovery point. We'll rendezvous with you there. Roger. What about the sentries? I managed to get past them. I see. Right. What about the boss? We lost contact with the boss some time ago. What Did happened? We? Uh -oh. It's probably just a weak signal. Just hurry and get Sokolov out of there. Uh huh. Uh huh. Wait. Sure, it's nothing. No problem. I don't want to do an escort quest. Too bad. You'll take it if you like it. No, I won't. I will definitely not like it. I'll take it because I don't have a choice, but I'm not going to like it. What? What is he doing? Are, are, are we serious right now? Is this motherfucker? No. Uh-huh. Is he gonna do Kamehameha? That or he's trying to use the force. <laughs> uh huh. I saw that. <clears throat> so what now? Exactly. Freeze! <gasps> Uh, no, apparently I won't be taking an no escort quest. I knew it, I'm surrounded by assholes. <laughs> so this is the legendary boss. Huh? Spurs. Hey. That jingle jangle. Huh? We meet at last. The circle is complete. You! You're from the Ocelot unit of Spetsnaz. Huh. Revolver Ocelot? What's a crew soldier doing here? Soldier? First class. Ah. He's the Ocelot commander. <laughs> so? That's Major Ocelot to you. Major asshole. And don't you forget it. <laughs> Sokolov is ours. Now get out of here. And Ocelot never lets his prey escape. What? <laughs> Dead. Dead. Ah! Dead. Ah! Dead. Ah! Dead. Uh, I wonder if Cody Weaver, what I'm seeing here, if we're planning to shoot somebody, don't talk, shoot! I mean, that's what Eli Wallach said in Good, Bad, and the Ugly. Exactly. And now he's dead shot. But he also wore a raspberry beret. <laughs> I went through all this trouble to sneak in here and you just show up and blow their heads off? Damn it, Ocelot. Yep. You're fucking awesome. Why can't I be you? I can't say it feels good to kill a comrade, even if it is for the Gru. <gasps> what about so the minions, Gru? Take cover. <laughs> King Bob! No, wait, different continuity. Huh. In 
You're not the boss, are you? You're not the boss of me. What? Did he just meow? Yes. Crew, and I'll break the cat. What well, is that? Deal with this right meow, then. Huh. <laughs> that gun. <laughs> 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 Lol. If you're not the boss, then die. Well, I guess I'm dead. That, that, see, that's what I expected you to do. Cry and run away. Shoot the other one. You guys have guns. You know that, right? Dead. Ha! Impossible. Unlikely. You ejected the first bullet by hand, didn't you? I see what you were trying to do. But testing a technique you've only heard about in the middle of battle wasn't very smart. You were asking to have your gun jam on you. Huh? Besides, I don't think you're cut out for an automatic in the first place. Yeah, you tend to I twist your you elbow to revolver. absorb the recoil. That's more of a revolver technique. Yep. You filthy American dog! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that happened. But that was some fancy shooting. You're pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good. <sighs> pretty good. <sighs> Dead. Well, oh, not really. We're not that fortunate, are we? Not that far. <laughs> And now I will pray. Press X very Major, quick. do you read me? I read you. Snake, you all right? I've That's run into a few snags. Perforated by bullets. These yeah. guys were after Sokolov too. Apparently, they were taking orders from a Gru colonel named Volgan. A Gru colonel? Part of an internal Soviet power struggle, according to Sokolov. Something between the KGB and Gru, between Khrushchev's supporters and Volgan's. Sokolov was being guarded by the KGB and hunted by Gru? Snake, it sounds like this could be even hotter than Cuba. I don't like it. Something about the whole thing stinks. I agree. You'd better hurry. Sokolov ran off by himself, but I'll catch up to him. We're counting on you. Aha. Uh -huh. Hey, young guns, mid ocelot. The Soviet government said, you know. Now I gotta find this fucker. Mm -hmm. Probably went out the back. Or not? The door is not open. Oh. Okay. Well, there's a thing I learned how to do. Knight gone off, gone off back toward the bridge. I wouldn't think. Oh. 
We should take a save. Good plan. Good plan. I like that plan. Saving the game, Snake? Bet your ass. We do not want to do that again. Snake, do you I know do. the creature from the Black Lagoon? Nope, never heard of it. These Boy. scientists are investigating a place deep in the Amazon called the Black Lagoon, and they get picked off one after the other by this fishman thing. And there was this scene when the heroine is going for a swim, and the creature sneaks up on her from underwater. Oh, I thought my heart was going to stop. I mean, of course, the 3D effects in It Came From Outer Space were a lot more intense, but... It wouldn't be referring to you coming from outer space, would it? How rude! Why do you say that? I would because no one space, on Earth right? could be as charming as you. Oh my god. <sighs> Fine. I'll just get to the point, Snake. Be careful of what's around you when you're in the water. Just imagining you swimming in those jungle rivers makes me think of you being attacked by a fish man. What? I appreciate the concern. Fishmen aren't the only things that'll attack you in the water. Really be careful out there. Okay. And don't be attacking any pretty girls going for a swim, either. Are you calling me a fish man? You started it. You brought up the boot. <laughs> oh my god. Look, real life lesson coming in from movies. Perfect. Alright, yeah, he must have gone off to the... Alright, hold on. Nope, uh, not that. This. You'll get it one day. Map. Yep, there's definitely a back end. Actually, I need to see something there. There's one room-type area there that I didn't see. I don't know what he's either dead or sleeping. Out cold, yep. Oh, hello. Something's here. That was med. That's probably some medicine. Yep, that was the one area I hadn't been to. So yeah, there's really only... There was also up the stairs, there was something around the console that you picked up there at one time. That's a good point. Yeah, you never went back to pick it up, so... Whoop. Hey! Ribbit. Oh, and my suppressor is dead. Uh, not, nothing here. That must have been something yes, one of those guys dropped. Alright, he must, he must have gone towards the bridge, then. Yep. If There's you look no... at your map, you can actually see the X for your destination. Oh, really? Yeah. Keep wanting Check map to be on select. Oh, yeah, so it is. Hardly seems to be a portion where we're going to sneak. Indubitably, good fellow. And there he is. Um. You okay? Those men were from the Ocelot unit, Spetsnaz. Yes. The best crew has to offer. They're coming for me. I'm finished. Oh my. Calm down. Well. I'll get you out of here, I promise. And we've got some of the best backup we could ask for. Look. that. Oh boy. That's what they were making you build. Yes. Oh, what if the we see the RV at the upper right? The Hold down that button. A tank a different capable camera. of launching nuclear IRBM. Yes. You can launch nuclear missiles from that kind of terrain. Oh yes. And without support from friendly units. A nuclear equipped tank capable of operating solo. Yep. Is that thing finished? No. This is only the end of phase one. 
Uh -huh. It won't be truly finished until we complete phase two. Phase two, two. My The weapon's true form. If it is completed and the Colonel gets his hands on it, it will mean the end of the Colonel. Cold War. The end of the Cold War? Yes. And then the Age of Fear will truly begin. A world uh -oh. war. I had no choice but to cooperate. I didn't want to die. Too late. What? I wanted to see my wife and child that? again in America. Please, take me to America. Quickly. I don't want it. They cannot complete it without my help. Well, we could kill you. Got it. Let's go. So about that escort. Why did you look down then, fucko? You'd think the guy would be smart. Scientists swear. You know, if I knew how long these cutscenes were, I could take a bathroom break. I don't think it is known to be pretty much a movie. With intermittent gameplay. Uh huh. Hey, the boss. Hey, Legolas. What? Boss? No, I'm sorry. It's some blade. No. <gasps> yes, yes. Fall off. Good. Push him off. Do it. You know you want to. Good work, Jack. What are you doing here? Sokolov comes with me. Uh-huh. Uh, what the hell is this? Huh? Well, you know. <laughs> Hornets. Tracker tackers. <laughs> what fucking fresh hell am I watching right now? I have so many questions. Ready to have more. I mean, there's the question of what this guy's deal is. My friends, let us fight together again. I have waited long for this day. Oh my god, what is that voice? We will fight with you once more. And that voice. I know that voice. Welcome back, boss. What the now fuck? all five of us are together, <laughs> it's time we go to the depths of hell itself. Uh, the Doomslayer will meet you there. <laughs> it's raining blood. Is he that, crying? That's not blood. I didn't hear Slayer tuning up, so it can't be raining blood. Kuabara, Kuabara. Um, Electro Man? Uh huh. Or you might call him Vulcan. Ah, what a joyful scene. Colonel Vogan. Welcome to my country. And to my unit. Uh. Boss, what is this? I'm defecting to the Soviet Union. Sokolov is a little gift for my new hosts. 
coilless nuclear warheads. What? These will make a fine gift for me. This can't be happening. Oh, Who is it's he? happening. All right. Why don't you just kill one of your disciples? Are we taking him with us? No. This one is still just a child. Too pure for us cobras. Cobra! He has not yet found an emotion to carry into battle. What are you talking what about? What even is this? What kind of standards do we have here right now? Huh? Okay, so yeah, I would have rather had the escort quest than have him be taken away, but well, here we are. How uh, about that? Well, that was cool. Oh, yes, snake. Those supposed to have arms. That's illegal. You've seen my face. They're not much to see, pal. We can't let him live. You ever hear of the X-Men? Specifically one named Storm? If Khrushchev finds out about this, we're finished. Ame. We must die. Ame. Wait. He's my apprentice. I'll take care of him. Always two, there are a master and an apprentice. Jack, you can't come with us. She touched me. <gasps> oh, she elbowed me in the stomach. Wait, that's not good. <laughs> She gave me the death touch to the chest yeah. and threw me off a bridge! Wait. Again, I don't think these are good things. And dead! The new blood has been rejected. Good night, everybody. We're done here. The whole thing was a wash. Ugh. Well, that's the first bath he's had in months, so we've got that here? going for him. Now, on to Sokolov's research facility. Uh, hey, Omega, how you doing? Shagohod is ours. I, I read Shadow Law or Shadow Hog, so, you know, you tell me which yes. is right. Yes. Drift also, away. when the, the big guy was uh, chanting like crochet, my place is with them now. Simply, that's a Japanese chant to keep away thunder. Also, I have some very serious questions about those straps and hooks and stuff that are specifically around her crotch. Like, why would those be uh, there? The protection, I guess. I am having a time with this game. Let me say that much. We are two hours in, yeah, and I've played the, for about 20 minutes. Yep, yep. We haven't got the tutorial yet. I, I am truly understanding Yahtzee Croshaw's uh, gripes with the Metal Gear series. Uh -huh. Snake, can you hear me? Nope. Yeah. Just barely. Mm. Snake. Listen to me, you need emergency medical treatment. Can you move? You've got to get those wounds treated. Hang in there. Hang in there. You said I had right, no back. Let's get you fixed up. Paramedic? Okay, Snake. Just relax and it'll all be over before you know it. Sounds like you're gonna put me out of my misery. Stay with me. I've seen people in worse shape before. Think I've you can been handle people it? in worse shape before. Major. Boss, she's defected. We'll talk about that later. First, we've got to get you patched up. Do we? Okay, here we go. Magically, First, open the, the survival viewer with the start button. If you select cure, you can start the treatment. 
What if I don't want to? Healing is divided into treatment using medicine with the item window button and surgical treatment using the weapon window button. Your injuries include a fractured left elbow and rib bone and lacerations on your upper arms, right elbow, and abdomen. What are we doing here? They need to be fixed using surgical Percy. treatment. Move the healing cursor with the left stick to the affected part of your body. Once you've selected the affected area, hold the weapon window button and use the left stick to select the medical item and then press the inner button. With this method, you can use items to help your recovery process. To treat a bone fracture, um. first secure the affected area with a fastener and then wrap it in bandages. That should do it. For lacerations, you'll need disinfectant to clean the wound, sutures to stitch it up, styptic to slow the flow of blood, and bandages to wrap the wound. If you do everything I mentioned, the wound should heal completely. Understood? No. Yeah. Stay with me. Go into the survival viewer and treat those wounds. I... Uh... Okay. Cure. Cure? Surgery. Okay, okay, broken bow, broken bone. Okay, um... Hold your red trigger. Well... Um... Okay, uh, let's see. Suture oh, kit. Oops. Uh, let's see, it's a broken bone, so I gotta wrap it in bandages, she said. Yep, uh, you gotta also use some septic, I believe, a splint. You still need a bandage. Oh, I gotta, I gotta cancel this. Don't think you can. Nope. Oh, you went back. What? Well, I did. Okay, so we disinfect the cut. Bleeding, no measures applied. Bleeding. Bleeding, I believe septic was measured that to prevent bleeding. Suffering from a deep cut. Cure 60%. And that... Uh... Disinfect. Septic. Bandage. I believe you still need to apply a splint to it. A uh, suture, suture. To take out the cut. I believe that should take care of the broken arm. Or not. Nice, that's taken care of. Bone fracture. Alright, so you gotta do every circles and apply for each one of them. Nice one, that. Okay, that's all those. Uh, bandage needs to be applied. Split. Oh, thank God. There you go. Survival! Right. Oh. Well, that's gonna hurt. At least you don't have to do those in the specific order, because that would be uh. annoying. Yeah. <sighs> 
senpai's bandana. Good job, Snake. Right. We're coming to get you now. You're Just stay where you it. are. We'll drop a recovery balloon. Can you set it up? No. Don't make me do that. I just want to play the game. You're ready to get to the game. <sighs> That's a lot of choppers. Oh, oh, yeah, right, this is. Great success. Thanks to the boss and her cobras, I have both Sokolov and the Shagohod. Now, missed opportunity to have this guy be played by Clancy Brown. What are we going to do with the girl? Who is she? Apparently she's Sokolov's woman. They have those around here. She's a nice catch. I'll take her. Not you know, so fast, my Peculiar is not seeing any Soviet insignias on any of those. Soviets were very much like the Nazis in the way they'd like to really just splatter their insignia death. on everything. Are you KGB? We may be able to use her. She has spunk. Shall we take her back to the base? Perhaps we should. We have no further use for Sokolov's research facility. I think it's time I gave this marvelous new toy what? a try. That thing is a freaking cartoon bazooka. Colonel, uh, oh, even if are our enemies, they're still our countrymen. But it won't be me that pulled the trigger. It'll be our friend, the American defector. You're going to nuke your fellow Russians? <laughs> oh, hey, that's it. The no Al Russian. Remember Colonel. the Alamo? Remember... What the hell's going on? He said he'd clean up. Look at this, is portable nuke launcher! And Snake's got his face burned off, and his dead. That's how it works with nukes. Yep. Welcome to Fallout, everybody. Yeah, Fallout Russia edition. Uh huh. Now your balls are news. Nothing of value was lost. <laughs> uh. 
Oh yeah, the Davy Crockett. Yeah, no, I, I learned about those. I actually read some Jack Reacher novels while I was gone. And uh, yeah, I learned the Davy Crockett's very much a real thing. And that's terrifying. Sure is. Nuke in the push of a button. Very portable. Here it is. Uh, this has got to be it. All right, let's let's yeah. let's go. The price of admission. That was worth the last two and a half hours we spent doing mostly watching freaking things. <laughs> this fucking James Bond fucking shit here. Power supply to payload antifree system shows no problems. No gusts. Main title designed by Maurice Binder. Snake, we can't Title theme written by time Weird time Al Yankovic. But... Airspace security has gotten tighter since we were last here. Oh we can't God. get as close to the ground as we did during the Virtuous mission. <laughs> so instead, we'll be using one of our newest weapons. I unironically Snake, love it. That was insane. This is our last this chance. Must be everything Show your patriotism. If you fail, you'll be back in a hospital bed again, waiting for the firing squad. Oh boy, hey. By the way, what's happening? I'm too busy marveling at that freaking opening sequence. So how does it feel to be a patient in one of the most advanced ICUs in the world? Would you do me a favor and tell the suits about visiting hours? I'll never get better with them assaulting me day and night with their questions. And their penises. Must Wait, be part what? of the top brass's inquiry. More like an interrogation. According to them, I'm a traitor and an accomplice to the boss's defection. They're just looking for a scapegoat. Does that mean they're after you too? Oh my god. Let's just say neither one of us is going to be made a national hero out of this. 
does you this don't mean say. Fox is going to die? Okay. No. This fox is still Last one night. step ahead of the hounds. The reason I came to see you today, Jack, it's time for Fox to clear its name. What are you talking about? The situation has changed. We still got a chance to come out of this one alive. Yeah, what kind of chance? Don't get too uh, excited. 0.68%. Here, have a cigar. It's Cuba. Like your mother. This morning, I had a meeting with the CIA. But I they decided when they're going to execute us? No. Something even bigger. Yesterday, the White House received an unexpected call. President Johnson? Yes, I hear you, Mr. Chairman. It was a hotline call from Khrushchev to President Johnson. From the head of the Soviet Union? That's right. The General Secretary, that's the A guy. A few days ago, one of our country's main design bureaus, OKB-754, ah, was destroyed in a nuclear explosion. Wow. At about the same time, our anti-aircraft radar picked up a signature that picked appeared up. to come from one of your military aircraft. Oh. Does any of this sound familiar to you? In retaliation, I have placed our armed forces on secondary alert. Depending on your response, I may be left with no choice but to I order the military to maximum alert and uh, unleash literally. Armageddon. Ooh, Armageddon. With the help of your predecessor, I was able to survive the Cuban incident. True. But my power is not as great as it once was. You would say it's not if I am to survive anymore? this crisis. I must have your full cooperation. Your full cooperation. I should have contacted you myself. Oh Did my you God. know That's not that even a one good of our Johnson soldiers impression. defected to your country a week ago? Just, no. just giving so speaking in a Texan accent that. is not a Johnson. The man who arranged the defection was a Gru colonel by the name of Yev The Jeopardy is not half correct. Volgen of the Brezhnev faction. Leonid Brezhnev, Lenny Bruce, and Lister Pat, first of Party Cheesecake, Jelly Bean. Her boom. name is the boss. She's a living legend. It's not her real name. During World War II, she was the one who led us to victory in that war. What a what in no Russia, you know her No she wasn't. What about Eisenhower you and mean, Bradley and MacArthur and any of the other motherfuckers the who mother actually did the job? Forces. Yeah, that's the one. And she took two miniature nuclear shells along with her. The because we make those took now. Two miniature nuclear mm -hmm. shells. I'm afraid so. I believe they were a gift for her new hosts. The Davy Crockett Atomic Battle Group delivery system was completed two years ago. But serious problems were found with the launcher's range and precision. Although they were mass produced, they've never been deployed in battle. Yes, ten but cases of the research I facility was blood. completely wiped out. The whole area is polluted. I can only offer you my deepest condolences over this terrible tragedy. Yo. So the boss, with Colonel Volgen's help, stole two experimental nuclear shells and took them with her as gift when she defected. Then, shortly thereafter, Sokolov's design lab, a top-secret military research facility, was destroyed by one of these weapons. Am I right so far? You've summed up the part yes, of the game correct. so far pretty well. And the American government denies any involvement in the effect. Which means is you should see, right as, as well. well as we do, that this is That's correct. We completely were not involved ludicrous. In any way. <laughs> then what was a U.S. military aircraft doing on our radar screen? It was clearly in a violation of our airspace. Oh my God. And yet you say it was not acting under your orders. That's correct. I do not have nearly enough alcohol to, to get through that this right was now. All the work of and I can't drink soldier. anyway because I got to work in the morning. I don't know what else to tell you. The army insists that this is all a ploy. On this fake of the snake eater. I've said it yes. once and I'll say it again. Our government had nothing to do with it. And I would like dearly to believe you. However, I'm afraid my power over the military has weakened since the Cuban incident. I'll bet. I will need some kind of proof that this was not the action of the American government. Okay, send him a dick pic. You have one week 
You must catch the boss yourselves and recover the remaining nuclear device. Then you must find some way to prove your innocence. Prove our innocence? Yes, preferably something painful. Okay, Prove to off. me that this is not merely another one of your tricks. The boss should be close to Colonel Volgan. How about a little co-action? I would not expect too much if I were you. The political situation here is unstable. You don't say. And Colonel Volgan is a member of the Brezhnev faction, which seeks to topple my government. One week. You have only one week. And if it is not too much to ask, do something about Volgan as well. Uh -huh. What is that supposed to mean? Nothing means nothing. Well, electrocute him. Oh, wait, Call it a help. modest gentleman's agreement mm. to ensure our continued relationship. I'll dunk him in the Atlantic. That ought to do it. What if we can't prove our innocence? Then I will be unable to restrain the military. I will be ousted, and they will seek their revenge. Something, something, no Russian. A nuclear attack on the United States? I leave the disposal of this situation entirely to your discretion, Mr. President. Disposal? Well, yep. If you fail, it will mean the beginning of a new world war. Right. To put it simply, in order to avoid a full-scale nuclear conflict, we have to prove that America was not involved in that explosion. Yeah. And eliminating the boss ourselves will prove America's innocence? Sure. Right. Why not? The higher ups have decided that you're the only one capable of pulling this off. The well, higher ups may you have been on apprentice. crack at the time. Screw this one up, and we'll both be six feet under. I got There's news no for chumps. you, pal. We're going to be six feet under whether we screw it up or not. Uh -huh. Are the Russians going to be helping us? Yeah, the Russians. The KGB be us. has promised to lend us one of their communications satellites so that you and I can talk to each other. Oh my! Who is That's this? It. They've also put us in touch with a couple of insiders. I mean, I'm not complaining, she's pretty. There was a defection in September 1960. Do you remember it? You mean the two NSA codebreakers who went over to the Soviet Union? Or are we talking about Lee Harvey Oswald? Since then, they've apparently been training with the KGB for exactly this kind of situation. Their code names are Adam and Eva. I've Adam been told and Eva? Adam has infiltrated Vulcan's e ranks. But also arranged for him to provide you with an escape route. You'll need to rendezvous with him when you get there. So I'll remind everybody, at 7.50 I'm going to do a face reveal and you can see the expressions on my face. 7.50 uh, follows. And you can see the expressions on my face when I'm flabbergasting like this. So get following. Control. Unidentified aircraft detected. Altitude 30,000 feet. Estimated airspeed exceeding Mach 3. Bearing south. Ah, I'm about not to too lose long it. before he hits warp one. Whoosh. Time for the next cutscene! So I feel like if you take out all the cutscenes, the actual gameplay is probably better. Watch out for that tree! Snake of the jungle. Confirmed. <laughs> this is Snake. Do you read me? Loud and clear. Glad to see you landed safely. I got blown pretty far off target. Yeah, Snake, you got blown all let's right. Let's go over your mission objectives one more time. Rescue Sokolov. Find no. out what's happened to the Shagahod. 
then destroy it. And Maybe. finally, eliminate the boss. Eliminate the boss. I don't want to. This mission will be codenamed Operation Snake Eater. Snake Because I'll be taking on the boss in our Cobra unit, right? Don't forget about Colonel Volk. I'm not a hired killer. You I know. Are now. But that was the Kremlin's demand. Demand? You mean it wasn't just a request? What do you think What's this it is? to us if the Khrushchev regime is threatened by the Colonel and his faction? If well. supporting the current regime helps us avoid a nuclear exchange, then that's what we'll do. And what are the CIA's demands? Our priorities are the rescue Naked of Sokolov of and the destruction of the Shagahod. Roger that, Major Tom. Hold Ground on, Snake. Control calling. What now? I'm changing my code name. It turns out Tom wasn't the most auspicious choice. No what kidding. Well, the truth is, when I chose my code name, I picked the wrong one. The wrong one? What? Did you ever see the movie The Great Escape? It came out last year. I oh, must have missed that one. Anyway, it's based on a true story about prisoners who escaped from a POW camp in Nazi Germany. The prisoners dig three tunnels as part of their plan, but the Nazis find two of the tunnels before they're finished. If this was the, the prisoners movie succeed in escaping by using the last remaining as, tunnel. Um, the names of those three seen. tunnels were Dick, Harry, and Tom. I get it. You used the name of the tunnel they escaped in as your code Tom, name because you thought it would bring you good really. luck. Yes, that's exactly right. At yeah, least I've seen The Great Escape, plan. though it has but, been a very long time. But I got I the name wrong. The one they escaped in was Harry. Tom was one of the unlucky tunnels. It was discovered by the Nazis before it was finished. Uh -oh. Nazis. I watched the movie that's again so just to make sure. In fact, I even ordered the actual film from the movie company. Yeah, it doesn't sound like the greatest name to use. So what should I call you? Harry hmm. Balzania. You know, let's just use Zero, like we've been doing all along. Oh, God. All right, then. Major so Zero So what was the is. point of any... We'll start over from square one. What from the, square the... zero. Mm. My frequency uh, is one, four, yeah. zero. Why <laughs> was this necessary? Oh, Why was this I almost forgot. Paramedic needed. is with us again on this mission. Why was there is Major Tom and then this explanation and then he changes fail, to not Major Tom anymore? What's the revoked. point? It's more or less the same kind it's of thing. So salty! Her frequency <laughs> is the same as during the Virtuous mission. 145.73. She'll be recording your mission data as well, just like the last time. That frequency is also the same. 140.96. Gee, thanks, Steve. And there's one more person on your support team. His name is Mr. Sigint. He's an expert on the latest in weapons and equipment uh, technology. Uh, I'm sure he's You'll got You'll be going frequency. up against some of the world's most advanced weaponry when you infiltrate the research facility. If you have any Go questions, on. just ask him. His frequency is 148.41. Mr. Sigint, got it. Adam, your KGB contact, is waiting for you at the abandoned factory up ahead. The I'll same factory is. Sokolov was being held in last week. Yes, meet up with Adam first. He's cleared the way for you to rescue Sokolov. How will I know this Adam guy when I see him? It looks You'll like know Otacon. once you reach the factory. The whole area's been polluted by the fallout from that nuclear blast. No one else would dare come close. The password is... Who are the Patriots? And Lali Lulelo. Lali Lulelo. Gotcha. Should I write You've that down? You've been equipped down? with a 45 like for this mission. Be careful, it's noisy. I thought standard Fox procedure was procure on-site weapons acquisition. The circumstances are different this time. Lally. You're now on an official mission for the United Lally States Lally government. Lally. It would be necessary to make your presence known to a certain extent. To the Khrushchev regime, at the very least. But remember, this is still a sneaking mission. Yeah, you know I'm going to fuck that up, If right? you fail this mission, it will mean an all-out nuclear war. Keep that in mind and proceed with extreme caution. As long Understood. as there's pits I can throw Commencing myself into Operation to Snake Eater. fucking nonsense. <laughs> You'll be fine. Snake Eater. Yeah, uh, Mr. Singit, as long as you have an equip, uh, a weapon equipped and call him, he'll tell you all about that weapon. Okay. I don't understand the point yeah. of that, but alright. Little details, what a weapon can do, the functions of it. Same thing with anything you've got equipped for your equipment, uh, the equipment slot. Okay, well, let's see. Let's take a look at our backpack. <laughs> they took away your shotgun. They did. How am I supposed to be Doom Guy without the shotgun? I didn't even get to use it.
Everybody was down by the time I picked yeah. it up. Like it was waterlogged when you when you when you fish you out of the river. Boy, that um, that looks. Are we sure we want to go way, with that? It? That sure uh -huh. as hell looks a certain way, doesn't it? Uh, at least the lips aren't, you know. Oh hi. Um. All right. Yeah. Hi, Raiden. Oh, that's Raiden. Ah, close enough. I almost feel like I should be black here, as far as uniform, anyway. Well, let's take a look at the whole thing. Yep, that sure exists, also, doesn't it? Uh huh. You do see the camel index on in the upper right corner too, so you know how how well camel you are with that. Yep. <clears throat> I am immediately 35% now. Yep. The black face paint. Standing up. Okay. I mean, you know, black face paint is very much a thing that exists. It's, you know, he's, he's not... Being a black person is camouflage. I'm not trying to justify anything yeah. here, but it's a fact of what it is. Indeed. If the lips were, like, well, white, pinks, etc., then you could go straight up blackface, but camel is camel. It's. it's... Yeah. I Plus mean. Eight. You know, the game came with the. Um, with certain uh, disclaimers about um, how, what the time it was made. Now, I don't really think that the, the, the black camo has anything to do with that. Because, again, that is, that is a thing that is done. That's actually done. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. This looks like the same damn area I was before. Whoa! It is! Trojan man, what? Ah, what? yes, to, to keep the snake contained. Why was there a horse? Ah. Uh. Paramedic. Snake, it's so good to hear from you again. Same here. It's been a week, hasn't it? Four days, actually. Huh? I visited you in the hospital. You were still unconscious, though. Ah, then you must have seen me naked. What? Yeah, but you were all wrapped up in bandages and tubes, so I couldn't do anything but look. Better Why? Than next time. Mm, let's hope so. Let's but not. But seriously. Don't forget that you were like that until just game? yesterday. Yeah. In fact, game. you really shouldn't even this be This is not this how mission. women are. Keep an eye on your stamina gauge. If you start to run low, don't push yourself. Eat something to replenish your stamina. And try not to get yourself hurt. If you're wounded or get bitten by a venomous animal, go into the survival viewer immediately and treat yourself using cure. Oh boy. Yeah, yeah. I can see you still know how to nag. You're welcome. And I can see you still don't know when to keep your mouth shut. Maybe so. By the way, I heard you're going to lose your medical license if this mission fails. Yes, there was talk of that, but the mission won't fail. Why would her medical Will license have anything to not. do with this? Good. I believe in you. But you know what? I really don't care about my medical license. Didn't they use that to force you to participate in this operation? No, I volunteered. Why? So that I could watch over you. Huh. Snake, you're the best agent I've ever seen. But you push yourself too hard. You're reckless. Someone has to stop you from getting into trouble to make sure you and the boss don't kill each other. The, 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 they have to so kill that's them. why I volunteered. I mean, you couldn't ask for a better guardian angel than me, right? Thanks. No. Stop right there. <laughs> no. You can thank me when you get back. All right. Ugh. Uh, 
I'm creating a new file for this so that I can actually rewatch the um the the, intro. the opening movie scene at any time. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm sure I could do it on YouTube, and, which is what I could have done at any time before this. But you know what? Fuck that. The, the, I have access to okay, Good luck, Snake. Thanks. Also, are we sure she's not the snake eater? Wait. I mean, it sounds like he wants her to eat his snake. Uh, and this uh. is why you call the Trojan Man. Uh, another cutscene. I don't know specifically where we're raiding to at the end, but I feel like our raid mesh is going to have something to do with three hours of cutscenes. Sounds about right. Looks like death wasn't ready for you yet. He was busy. He's getting his sickle sharpened. Boss. That arm still hurt? What are you doing here? Something on a grafting or something on a possessed arm or something in later installments. I know this. Well, nope, game over. My bruise, Brew and my sons are waiting up ahead. Just, uh, you, know, out you don't have like a that. prayer of finishing your mission. Yeah. You're not even armed. Belt them in a belt below them so that you can see them and they're projected out. Boss! <sighs> I'm not your boss anymore. Yeah. There's nothing for it's, you here. It sure is some kind of game, isn't it? Go home. Uh -huh. Go back to your boss. There's Welcome no in, need uh, to prove that you're virtuous here. Pren uh, let's see if I'm pronouncing that correctly. This isn't America. See, you don't have guns like that in America, do you? That should stir things up a bit. You'd better hurry. What? The border is 60 miles south and, of here. And what is she? You ought to be able to run that far. Yes, this is my first time playing this. I thoroughly enjoyed the James Bond style opening, that? which I'd been uh, promised was going to be I completely worth my time. And it was. I'm loyal to the it end, was. to my purpose. What about you, Jack? We are uh, going to be playing this What's it going through to, be? to completion. Loyalty to your Not country tonight, or maybe. loyalty to me? But, your uh, country or your old mentor? You know, the mission the or your weeks, beliefs? However long it takes. Your duty to your unit or your personal feelings? <laughs> you don't know the truth yet. Nobody knows the But truth. sooner or later, you'll have to choose. I'm not sure Kojima knows I don't the expect truth. you to forgive me. But you can't defeat me, either. Oh, I you suspect we're going to change that. Just look at that bandana. If you can't put the past behind you, you won't survive long. What does the bandana have to do? That seems unnecessary, but okay, sure, fine. Now, go home. She came here on a horse, knowing that he'd be here, and had the horse break his hand. Just, just 
Just this laying is that out there. Major Zero. So that everybody. I read clear. you, Snake. I was ambushed by the boss. You were what? The drone's been shot to hell. It's up in flames. That's not good. Enemy scouts are going to come looking for you. Yeah, I know. But what was the well, boss doing here in the some, first place? Uh, There's got to be a leak somewhere. No, that's there impossible. Other the man times, the boss is working with, uh, Volgan, isn't exactly on speaking know. terms with Khrushchev. I lost my gun. Going for about, the boss uh, destroyed three it. Hours now, Snake, so. I know how you're feeling. Earlier it's hard for is me to believe too that a legendary hero like the boss would go over to the Russians. And everything will get posted to my like YouTube this. in the end, too. But that's how it is, and if you don't Earth. accept it, you'll never be able to beat her. That's not the problem. In terms of sheer technique, I'll never be able to beat her. I know that all too well. But you You've know, you got always to watch do the it, VODs, Snake. Too. She's your enemy you know. and your objective. Enemy? We were together for ten years, and now you tell me she's my enemy? Enough. Hurry to the factory where Adam is waiting. Scouts so have probably like already been sent the, out to investigate follow, yeah, the explosion. You know, you know, easily have You've lost your weapon, right? That means you've got My no chance of winning in a battle situation. Can. Whatever you do, don't let them see you. Yeah, don't let them see me. Well, we saw what happened last time, don't we? Count down until he gets found. Who's that? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the follow here. <laughs> <laughs> Immediately he discovered. Dang it! Dang it! Dang it! I don't. <laughs> Why? Why did that happen? Because you stood around and found out. What I, else? I guess I did, didn't I? Okay. On the ground. Uh, We're good to go now. My goodness. I, I just... Oh, there, was, my God. there was something on fire. They had marshmallows. And said, hey, let's go find out. I guess I didn't expect them to show up that quickly. <laughs> I, I, if you saw something in a forest on fire, you'd hurry. You know you have to be on the line at that point. I mean, that's certainly true. Ugh. Okay, interesting though, I'm 75% um, even without being in the grass. Only 85%. Nice I wonder if I can get 100%. Can Do you know? Check. Um, good question. Let me check. I don't know if you can do it now, but... I can get 95%. Ooh. There we go. It's good stuff. Yeah, we got the achievement for 90%, so... It's worth, uh... Trying to get... To see if the, um... If it could go any, uh... Higher, so if we did learn now that... 95% is as high as it goes. Good call. It's good. Oh, not really something I can do? Okay. Alright, now those guys are completely distracted and elsewhere. I gotta look for more frogs to shoot, too. Must not forget those. I am assuming that there's like a Chivo for shooting them all. Of course. I mean, I figure if there's, you know, um, an achievement for shooting all those little uh, raccoons and the little dudes in RE2 and RE3. Eh, speaking of shooting something. Yeah. Nothing to see here but us blades of grass. How close can you get till he finds you? I mean, as long as he can't smell me, I think we're okay. <laughs> that may be a problem. Yeah, yeah, I mean, Snake hasn't showered in, you know, a month. Which is weird, because he's only been in captivity for a week. In captivity of the hospital. 
Which even in a hospital will at least give you a sponge bath. You know how I know? I've been in the hospital. I've received one. Okay, there we go. I'm like, come on, camera. I know you know how to zoom out of this. Problem is, I can't see for shit as far as where he is. Um, All right, there he is. If you within the inventory on the left side, there should be one that's marked as a radar. Inventory, huh? If, if you hold your L2 button, and there should be an option for a radar motion detector. Sonar motion D. That consumes battery power. All right. All right. I'm trying to figure out why that matters to me. Uh, snake, it please. Motion. Huh? What's that? Nothing but us raccoons. Who's that? <laughs> No, Snake, get up! Why can't you run faster, Snake? He has no limits, he's a snake! Oh no! Oh, this may have been a bad spot to go. Oh man. Yep. Problem I wound up there was uh, the controls versus. Um, hey, frog. HQ, HQ. Yummy. This is HQ. Control here. Mm, Taste like chicken. We've lost sight of the intruder. Going into high alert. Acknowledged. The enemy is still nearby. Pursue and engage him. <laughs> Juicy. It's interesting that I'm the red dot. Can you see how the re the sonar looks? Hmm, I don't think that's quite as effective. Yeah, I'm gonna the say that. I don't actually know really even. Stun grenade? <laughs> yeah, at that pace the game will get long, yep. I, I expect this to take a while. I, I, very much adapting to the controls, and of course, you know, with all the frickin' um, cutscenes, I'm not getting, you know, you don't get a whole lot of time to work with to get it down. It is what it is. Rather than waiting here for the time to pass or watch a movie. Yeah. Well, it doesn't look like these guys are anywhere near me, so that's a plus. Hey, that's a snake in the in the air. Was that just a vine? Uh, I think it's a sneaky snake. Rolling that ninety-five percent. This is 
HQ. Patrol here. No problem. Understood. Return to your position. Right. Let's um let's try that again, shall we? Let's uh as a matter of fact, let's, let's check out our map. Whoops. Held it for too long. Okay, so yeah. We definitely have to go that way. I can get him while he's going around the tree. Um, don't come here. 95% camo, fucko. You can't see me. I'm John Cena. <laughs> Alright. Good boy. You know you gotta st stop standing up to trees. Uh huh. It's not good for your health. Nope. Okay, we're good here now. I mean, the camo cover ain't that great, but he's not gonna look here, right? Right. 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 Turn around, dipshit. <laughs> From zero to ninety five percent in one row. Yep. Yay! Made the screen change. Checkpoint. Oh, this should look familiar. It does, as a matter of fact. That beehive is back. <laughs> it's been a week, you had time to rebuild. Unfortunately, you don't have a gun. Nope. What the fuck? <laughs> I can't get down. Get down, get down, and move it around. Got a little problem with pad down, I guess. Or not! I had to do that the zany way. As you do. Okay, so, how am I supposed to get past this guy? I'm not sure if it's a problem with getting past that guy or getting past the guy at the other end of the bridge. There is one. Is there one? I don't know. Huh? If it did post a single guy there? It looks like they may have posted just the one guy. I'm just going to sneaky sneak behind him and uh, shank. Hold your best among us. Press the L to stab. Press extra kill for <coughs> combo attack. Whoops. <coughs> How am I supposed to do get climb up from there? I could I mean, be wrong! I mean, unless it's up on the control stick. I mean, if it, if it, uh, if it's up on the control stick, uh, then it wasn't right. That's why the first thing I tried. So. Now there he is. You're 
He was the only guy. Yep. Uh, one little thing you can do here, unequip your knife and then press, uh, well, you just clear your X right over the body. You should be able to lift him off of the Here we need to kind of that and kind of shake him a little bit. Moving around a little bit, uh, right? Might shake off some equipment off him. Oh, like so. Sure did. Calf G. Ooh, chaff grenades. These don't explode to do damage, but these allow release some anti-electronic uh, sinking area blast. Uh huh. We'll take out cameras, lasers, etc. I'm just gonna try to take it slow across this bridge because apparently, you know, I have a tendency to fall. Uh-huh. Bridge is slippery in the wet. I guess. It's the bridge from Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom. Ah! I mean not wrong. Would that move have come out at this point? Uh, 1985? Yeah, no. Yeah, no. One of the two movies most responsible for the, uh, creation of the PG-13 rating, for those who may not be aware. Really? Yep. It is Temple of Doom and Gremlin that are primarily responsible for that rating's existence. Because if you really think about it, if you watch Gremlins, how the hell is that PG? Yeah, not wrong. Okay, we're here again, as expected. Now, there don't appear to be any dudes here. Not this time. Why they don't have a prisoner to guard anymore? Ah, that's a good point. I feel like if there's nobody here, then there's no point in sneaking around. May as well see if there's any goodies here. I don't expect there to be, but I could be wrong. You won't know if you check. Yep, we won't know check if we don't look. Oh. Yeah. Ooh. Who needs stealth when you've got an AK-47? Oh, boy. Mm hmm. Game on. What else was that? The classical Russian weapon. Ye old AK. Yep. Should be a button to let you climb up that, right? Oh wait, uh, yeah, well it was why to climb the tree. Okay. Yep. C box. A. Cardboard box! Yes, exactly. Showtime. Showtime. It's showtime. It's showtime. Feels like a month ago I was here rescuing some kind of scientist. Yeah, I do have a question about that. Doesn't seem to be a bathroom here. Did he just shit in the fireplace or what? Surely there's only in the nature for that, right? I mean, maybe. Oh! I am based in the eastern U.S. Oh. Sorry I'm late. 
Cut the Who engine. Are you? They'll hear us. Are you the agent they sent? Are you Adam? I thought you were supposed to be a man. Adam How couldn't make it. Fitting. All right, say the password. <laughs> Who are the Patriots? The Who are the Patriots? Answer me! Boy, nothing gets past Get you, down. Snake. I think that one guy was reacting to being shot before he was actually shot. Work. Oh. Nice shooting. your answer. No, she really didn't answer the question, did she? Yep. For the love yeah, of God. Yeah, yeah. I, I knew it. I knew it. I'm only doing that once, game. Fuck you. <laughs> I well, am yes, not. Does that a lot. Uh, I am not like that. I have a fiance. This was Hers are the only plan. ones I care what about. Happened to Adam? What's your code name? It's Snake. Naked Snake. Snake, huh? Also, well, I'm Eva. Are you here just, to tempt me? I don't think they understand how cleavage works either. What happened to Adam? They, they just work with the enemy rules. Colonel Volgan is a very suspicious man. He decided uh, Adam wasn't the right yeah, person. Come on, position. game. And you were. Camera right yes. on, her, on her chest. Because I can do things he, he can't. Like turn a snake. I heard you used to be a code breaker for the NSA. It's amazing that he's able to keep his mind ago, on topic to right now. Four years ago, I Union with Adam. Uh. Mauser military. The broom handle. It packs quite a punch. Nice to have when you're on a bike. You held it sideways and used the muzzle jump to create a horizontal sweep. That uh. was impressive. Bet you've never seen that technique in the West. Well, you want to It's bet? imitation, isn't it? Yeah. It's a Chinese Type 17 pistol. Around here. Even that's hard to come by. I'm Don't worry, still though. trying to figure what something out here. You is American One made. thing above ah. all else. Answer me this. Why did she unzip her um, huh? jumpsuit in the first place? Hmm. The second question, like, of course, being... Like why didn't she zip it back up yet? The feeding ramp is polished to yeah, a mirror. Yeah, okay, sheen. I get it. Boobs. Fun. Great. I love boobs the, the same as the, the next straight man. For added precision. And, but I, honestly, as far as I've been able to be made, made aware, pretty much Thumb everybody loves extended to make it easier on the I finger. get that. It's Long great. Type but I don't see the grooves. point of why this is happening. The and why she didn't zip back up. Hell, why is she wearing a bikini top? Nearly every part of this gun has been expertly crafted and customized. Now this guy, in the meantime, he has been geeking out over this around this gun. Uh, Snake, the world's first fully defined amosexual. Where'd you get something like this? I grabbed it from a Western uh. munitions armory. It probably used to belong to one of your officers, and there are more where that came from. You had this with you, didn't you? Well, it's just squeezes right at hands around it. Yeah, uh huh. Better take this too. Get a good What's grip. that? A disguise to make you look like a scientist. Nobody's going to believe he's a scientist. You yes. look at his face. You're here to rescue Sokolov, right? Sokolov's still safe then. Yes. He's being forced to continue his work on the Shagohat. 
Where? Oh, yeah, I mean, I, mm-hmm. At the lab. Mail gaze. They've got a whole army of scientists there developing uh, new weapons. I, I'm Security no expert. Tight, but if you I will give you this much. I will. You might be able to sneak in. Not, I'm no expert, but I know full well that if you're a woman, can we get so out of there? A badass we'll agent we? like she is, you're gonna Tell wear a to sports to bra. You're gonna need to keep those things the safest in way place. Is from the rear. Yep. Oh yeah. Especially when I need something like a motorcycle. The jungle. You'll come to a heliport used yeah, for Eastern U.S. materials. Pass the heliport and continue north, and there I will be a from large Detroit. crevice. Descend into that area, and you'll reach a cave. Hence the DTW. Move through the cave, and you will arrive at a mangrove code. swamp. After the swamp, there'll be a warehouse. Swamp, Make your warehouse, way through the warehouse, boobs. and you'll come out just south of the lab. South of the Got lab, it. boobs. And just Sorry, what are you I've doing been listening. There? Boobs. <laughs> boobs. In close-range combat, a knife can sometimes be more useful than a gun. By doing this, I'll be able to hold a knife at the same time and still keep the gun steady. That way, I can instantly switch between a gun battle and a knife fight. Uh, gun blade. I've, right. I've seen Final Fantasy VIII. Wait I've played it, but I've seen it. What now? You must be oh, tired. Boy. Why don't you take a little rest? Tired. You don't know I'll that protein does the same thing? Oh, wow. Man. Uh, it you'll is, never um, make it in your it's condition. It's a quarter after 11 here right now. It's a jungle out there. <laughs> There's still an hour before dawn. It's dangerous to be out in the jungle at night without a guide. It's dangerous to go alone. What about Take you? This. I have to get back. Yeah. I can't be gone for too long. My boobs and I'll I start have to, to get back. Something. Uh, you have to give you a reason to keep going. Don't worry. I'll keep you updated over the radio. That's it. Good, and our frequency. My orders are to provide you with information. And Nothing boobs. more. Except boobs. Uh-huh. You look disappointed. Keep you motivated. All right, then. Yeah. I'll do something special for you. Boobs. Uh-oh. Do you know what the term motorboat means? I'll stand watch until dawn. Now be a good boy and lie down. I can't lie down <laughs> right now. Something's gonna yeah. gonna poke out. I'm What's just the matter? Saying. I don't know you well, well enough he, to trust you. How well do you have to know me to trust me? Aren't my boobs enough for you to trust me? I don't know if I can trust anybody. Serving them everywhere, after all. Yep. She knows the best. Assets. Gonna get that. Yeah, that bed is huge. But again, there's no toilet here. <laughs> mm -hmm. Just take him out to the woods when he shits. I, I, just, I want answers. She's right, Snake. You should get some sleep. Although, in your condition, you really ought to be back in the ICU. Whenever yeah, you save the game and quit, you go to They say you need to check in if your erection lasts Sleeping longer allows than four you to gain hours. back stamina naturally. <laughs> Depending on how long you sleep, you may also recover naturally from sickness and injury. When you're tired or hurt, the best thing to do is just get some sleep. So do yourself a favor and take a nap. Doctor's orders, okay? <sighs> yeah, okay. Well, I am a man who loves his naps and sleep in general. Yep. Yeah, she felt competition. <laughs> that sounds right to me. <laughs> it's like she knew. <laughs> You're staring at her boobs, aren't you, Snake? I'm jealous. Again, this is not how women work. <sighs> Look, they're really going with the James Bond angle. They really are. You know, I'll be brutally honest with you. I would. I wish Leedsy were here right now to be giving us some feedback on this as well. <laughs> but Viner, shouldn't be too much of a problem. Yeah, I wouldn't think so. I'll tell her go ahead and watch the VOD if you've got a couple of hours. Um, in in the in the coming uh, few days, and uh, oh, God. Okay, oh. again, I have questions. Why? <gasps> Why is she in her underwear? What's the matter? We're surrounded. I see four of them. 
I mean, you're you're definitely right, ECL. MSG three is the We've got company. It's the MGS three is the best Bond movie here. ever made. Hurry. <laughs> Don't forget your gear. You're still not zipping up that. Here, are you? Give me a hand. Yep. Nope. She sure as hell didn't zip back up. Nope. She went through the trouble of putting the damn thing on. We can use this to get to the basement. <laughs> she sure as hell didn't bother to zip it up the rest of the way. You get dirt on those things, you know. Damn it! That's a lot. I'll get past them on my bike. I'll call you later. Ah yes. First okay. Then the pussy I'll keep busy. Mm. Huh? <laughs> Don't go dying on me now. I, I think they're supposed to make a remaster of this. The uh, there's the the, the trilogy was released. Um, on console, I thought it was remastered. I could be wrong. Hmm. The last version I remember was a 3DS one. Oh, do I not get to change <gasps> weapons? Uh, you need to go to your backpack. Okay. Keep pressing select for the backpack when that's not... Okay, here we go. Bad habits, you know? Batman trains you well. Eh, 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 eh. Kill them all, <laughs> I say. I have options now. What? 301 bullets. I see him! I started keeping busy, I didn't say I wasn't going to kill him. He sees me, but I don't see him. And it's not fair. The guy's smart. Too smart. SMRT. I see him. Yeah, he's up there. Ladder. Oh, right, I have to uh, do that. I can, yeah, or tapping I can... your R2 will uh, take off the gun and put it back on afterwards. And then X, I believe. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Swing your partner, do si do There you go. No, mine. Ooh, 150 bullets. Indeed. Each one of these, I believe, will only drop one thing, but still. Oh, 
Can I get a cutscene? Uh, I am playing on Steam currently. I was going to use the PS2, but as it turns out, A. Woods has a copy of this on Steam, so... I've been waiting for this moment. Obi-Wan. Wow, we just introduced her, she showed us her boobs, and now we're going to kill her. That's it! That's the stance! I don't think so. What? Jeez, really? A female spy? Well? This bitch is wearing perfume. Jeez, really? And it took you this long to notice that, too. Wow. Stay where you are. I've had enough of your judo. Judo? I see you've got yourself a single action army. Easy, easy, easy. That's right. right. Close quarter combat. There'll be no accidents this time. Ugh. You call that an accident? I well, call that a few it things. It wouldn't have happened if you hadn't been showing off. What did you say? It's a nice gun. I'll give you that. But the engraving gives you no this tactical is my advantage rifle. This whatsoever. Is my gun. Unless you were planning to auction it off as a collector's item. <sighs> what if I was? And you're forgetting one more very basic thing. I talk a lot. You don't have what it takes to kill me. We'll see. Aw. No more bullets. You're laughing, boy. No bullets left. Ow. Let's be literal. Ah. I don't care who you are, that laying your ass on a on a seat or a jump from ten feet is gonna hurt. I mean yes, you probably got it better because you doesn't have junk to get fucked with, but still. Six shots. That thing only carries six shots. The Can I fire 176 eight. shots or 175? You have to get a feel for how many you have left. This is a high-class weapon. That's a great, it's not great for face tattoo people. you just got. Damn! <laughs> this isn't over yet. The right way. My lord. Jess! Don't shoot him! Ah. Yeah, let her shoot him! He's still young. <laughs> hey, yes, Kennedy, how you doing? You'll oh. regret stopping me. I probably will. Damn it! I've got to get back before he does! Finally, the gate is open. Indeed. Progress! Yeah, what a way to get there, too. Unfortunately, I don't get to pick up all that ammo that the dead guys had left me because they all evaporated. They all vanished. They all decomposed. Also, uh, Lizzie says she looked into it. Oh, okay. That's three frogs we've gotten now. Excellent. Yeah, we can. Uh, and he'll be back. Of course he'll be back. <laughs> uh, oh, hey. Bug juice. Bug juice? That should be a beverage. Bug juice is a beverage sometimes. Face zombie. That's the mask, I guess. Zombie A A. What's in your head? Uh, you get a feeling it's not great for camo. More like fearing your enemies and getting yourself shot in the head. Uh huh. Well, for a second, I thought I saw something uh, spinning over there. It was just the um. You spin the background. Me right round, sneaky. Right round. Right around, Snakey. 
me. You know, I know that Snake is based on Snake Plissken from Escape from New York. Ooh, ooh, oh, 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 Which is oh. a mind detector. Oh. We get to ah, look that's not going to come in handy anytime soon. Right, right, right. Ah, all right, have a good night, juniors. Thank you very much for dropping in and for the follow. Now, we're going to have to wrap up here pretty soon anyway, so this is going to work out pretty well. Thank goodness you can save any time, right? Yep. Saying which... Do you want to save? Quotes. Uh... Hooray. The save is to you by the fox. Snake, have you heard of It Came From Outer Space? Yeah, you told me already. So this astronomer sees a meteor, but it's really an alien spaceship, right? And the aliens start replacing the townspeople with clones and forcing them to help repair the ship. The 3D effects were quite realistic. I've got all the real I can handle here in the jungle. No, you don't get it. Precisely because it's realistic, with the images jumping out of the screen at you, it makes for a nice escape from reality. I have to admit it made my eyes tired, but it was really intense. Unfortunately, they don't make very many of those movies anymore. When did it come out? I was still in college, so probably about ten years ago? Guess I'm out of luck then. You know, they're coming out with household versions of video cassette recorders. One day you'll be able to see old movies anytime you want. Yeah. It'll yeah, be we'll like be having a movie theater either, in your so own home. I have to... Really? I have to it's work like if you had a record with movie film with etched next, onto it instead uh, of music. It'll minutes. work the same way. You're kidding. No, really. And someday they might make movies where you control the characters yourself. Sounds call like those magic. video games. It'll happen. Except make sure you yeah. stay alive. We tend to, see to play it's the well. games more than we've played this so far. <laughs> <laughs> we've gotten more cutscenes than gameplay. I don't know. The, the really good solid series is pretty much known for that. All the freaking time. Okay, I'll have to I'll have to see about the um, the overall sound. That's a snake. It's a snake. <clears throat> Ow! Yeah, you got poison. What? What? I have that cured. Yep, I might. Hey, uh, yeah, it's Nate Phil. Yeah, I sure am being eaten by the snake. Cure inject serum. Yay. And resolution. One probably does not want to eat poisonous snake anyway. And spider slugs don't go for the 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 hidden plant. Let's see. Well, that's a gator. Oh yeah, and he's got some. Uh, There. <laughs> crouch. Yay. Mm, dear. Smoke grenade. Smoke grenade. Oh. 
AK ammunition. Neat. Gotta check your backpack. Let's see here. Chaff grenade, smoke grenade. Otten frog? Ah, the frog you killed before. Yeah, that's right, your that's... food. So it is. Yeah, you can toss them out, probably lure out some other things to kill. They're bait. Bait, huh? Indeed, I believe. All right, well, let's get back on land and see how that works. Hmm. I don't see anything. That's what we got off the gator, so that was actually... Yeah, there's some big meat. Yeah, that was... Welcome to the middle of your solid big game, big game hunting. Uh-huh. Oh, fuck. I did. Crossbite's back! No, that was the gator. The gator whooped me with his tail. There we go. Alright, let's... I think I need to eat some. Too bad. Well, good. West tasty. So I assume, though, that in the end I'm going to have to cross this. I believe so. Yeah. Well, I'm thinking that maybe this is probably a good place to shut it down for the night. What's up? Uh, you want to save? Get a save. I know not really much happened aside from me uh, killing a couple of gators, but. Let's do it. Do we all mind, right? 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 Yeah. Hey, Snake, have you ever seen Forbidden Planet? Ooh, Forbidden no, Planet. I can't say I have. It's about this expedition that goes to the planet Altair 4 in an ultra fast spaceship. When they arrive, they meet the survivor of the last expedition, Dr. Morbius. Dr. Oh, well, Morbius was exploring time. the planet along with his daughter, Altera, and the versatile Robbie the Robot. Ignoring the doctor's warnings, the expedition team is suddenly attacked by an invisible creature called the Monster from the Id. The special effects they used for the science stuff were really neat. I wish I had a robot like Robbie that could make anything I wanted it to. I'm more interested in that invisible monster. If I were invisible, I wouldn't have to bother hiding or wearing camouflage. Maybe someday you'll be able to turn invisible. Yeah, that'll be the day. Hint, hint, that's done. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I think that will indeed do it for us tonight. So here it is, as always, your moment of zen. Let us find a raid target. Got a few options out there tonight. Mm. Death we do, death we do. Sure of that. Uh, Let's see. We can't forget to read message too. Yeah, three hour cutscene. Or. I like it. I like it. Let's see. Who shall we go to? Choices, choices, choices. Choices, choices, choices. Boy, I got a lot of options today. <laughs> It's Freddy! It is. You know what? I haven't gotten to raid Ileon for a while, so let's do that. Ooh. My 
hair started thinning in my early 20s. There we go. He's playing something called Slice and Dice. And our raid message, of course, will be that... Tower... Free hour cutscene! So, everybody, thank you so much for coming, as always. Uh, if you're not already following, I do appreciate it if you do. And uh, otherwise... We will see you on Sunday for um, two streams. I'm going to do a couple hours in the afternoon of uh, Mario 64. We are uh, a bit delayed on finishing that. But maybe we can uh, give that a shot. And then, um, yeah, 9 Eastern Sunday night uh, should be Borderlands 2 with Negatron. If for some reason it's not, then expect a uh, SMZ3 seed. So have a great rest of your night, and we will see you then. Later. On hell mode, single person that ever looped this.